So the next part that we're going to get into is for the manual muscle test of teres major, which is going to be basically opposite of what we did for teres minor. So I'm going to again cup underneath his arm to prevent him from using any other motions, and I'm going to ask him for this case just to go through medial rotation of the arm at the ground femoral joint, like so. Whenever you're ready, good. So that is the active component, a wrong. I'm going to bring him about halfway into that motion. Again, I'm going to be pushing on the radius and ulna and not so much on his wrist or his hand. I'm going to ask him to hold that position. We're going to go for five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent. Now, starting from this position here, can you please pull your arm all the way up through that action for me? Good. So there concludes our concentric component, and that is all three active break and concentric for the manual muscle test. The last part for Terry's major is to go through our length assessment. So I've switched hands. I'm going to be grabbing at his kind of radius and ulna, and I'm going to slowly bring his arm up into external rotation, which is lengthening Terry's major. Again, don't pull too hard and start to lift that whole shoulder up. So just until you feel that tissue engage and giving you a kind of a tissue stretch and feel right about there. And that concludes all the components for Terry's major.